All right, uh, time for another Rue tale. This is a story uh, that comes out of California back in the years when I worked for a place called uh, Cali Mex Iron. And uh, they had a couple of uh, different locations. So anyway, I was working for them and uh, we had a field crew. And on the field crew, uh, there was a guy and his nickname was Homeboy. Well, uh, Homeboy and his crew went out one day and they were doing some drilling in some concrete and they were having to through drill so they could put through uh, bolts from one side to the other. So they were drilling for these through bolts and they were struggling, having a little bit of difficulty making sure that they uh, got all the way through because they were having to drill from both sides in order to get uh, to reach in the middle. So <clears throat> they weren't real sure whether they were exactly doing the right thing or not. So uh, they were drilling away through both sides of this concrete wall. And um, while they were drilling, they were trying to figure out whether they would got through squarely or not. So Homeboy was not the tar sharpest tool in the shed. And uh, he decided that he would try to look to see if he could see daylight through the other side. So he put his eye down next to the hole, just about the time the guy on the other side blew through with air to clear the hole out. Well, guess what? Homeboy didn't have any safety glasses on, and so all that concrete dust went right through the hole and uh, into his eye. So he got a free trip to the clinic, and uh, they spent a good bit of time clearing his eye out from this concrete dust and he had a patch over it and <clears throat> sidelined him for a, a day or two so here's the problem first of all homeboy wasn't wearing any safety glasses that was number one number two uh homeboy didn't communicate with the guy on the other side of the wall he didn't shout and say hey i'm gonna check uh i'm um make sure nothing happens try to he did there was no real communication between him and the guy on the other side of the wall and so the result was he stuck his eye out there down there just about the time that the other guy blew through it with the the compressed air so a couple of dumb things happened and as a result of it it ended up with an eye injury he wasn't wearing safety glasses he didn't communicate with the other people on his crew and you ended up with an eye injury. Now, this can happen to anybody. Anybody, Everybody gets a chance to uh, make a bad move or do dumb stuff from time to time. We all get ourselves in situations where uh, we get caught. In this particular case, because Homeboy, first of all, wasn't wearing his glasses. Second, wasn't communicating with his partner. He ended up with an eye injury. Now, that could very easily happen to anybody under any given situation or circumstance but realize those two things are critically important first of all wear your ppe uh, we don't give it to you just uh, for you to have to keep in your bag or to keep on your around your neck or on your on the top of your head put your ppe on put your glasses on secondly when you are out on the job site make sure and communicate with your people because when you don't communicate with them they don't know what you're doing you don't know what they're doing and accidents happen just like this one where a homeboy put his eye down there by the hole just to, to at the wrong moment and uh, coincidentally the guy on the other side blew through it with the compressed air and he ended up with the eye injury so that's our rue tale for today remember homeboy and his uh in his eye and his glasses and uh, make sure and wear your ppe and make sure and communicate with your other crew members while you're in the process of getting your work done so we don't have injuries like this one.